What's up guys, I'm Ryan Sheckler. You asked the questions, so today I'm going to answer them on CCS TV. I grew up with uh, neighbors that were always like a lot older than me and uh, as a little kid you kind of just want to be like the big kids and so I would watch them skate like every day and just wanted to try it and so I started trying to skate and uh, fell in love with it instantly. Obviously was falling all over the place and you know there's just something really exciting about it so that's kind of where it all it all started and then I got into like Rodney Mullen and Tony Hawk and you know I was just psyched I just wanted to be a skater. Anywhere in Australia. I really like Australia. Uh, the, the food is amazing. The people are amazing. The skateboarding is absolutely awesome. Uh, all over Australia is just really, uh, really interesting and really exciting. And I like Australia a lot. I think with injuries, you really got to pay attention to what your body is telling you. If you don't feel like you're 100%, you know, definitely don't push it that hard. Uh, I always kind of just gradually get back into skating and get back into jumping and you know the injuries definitely set you back but they can also make you super strong and you know make you more focused on, on skateboarding. Freedom to travel the world and to skate what I want to skate just basically be my own you know be, be an individual skateboarding has, has given me that so I would say skateboarding is giving me freedom. You know, you got to be comfortable and you got to be confident. You know, there's always going to be that that little fear of like, oh man, like if I don't make this, it's going to, you know, there's going to be some serious consequences. But you know, that that's good to a certain extent. You want to have a little bit of that, but then you also want to just be able to to look at it and, and understand that you know how to do it and you know what it takes to get from top to bottom. So. Um, I would say just confidence and, and, and know how to fall. So I never really even thought about it. Like I'd skate castle events and you know, Jim Thebo gave me a pair of wheels and it was like my first free thing I ever got. And I just remember that day was so sick. And from then, you know, I got a shop sponsor when I was seven. And every time I did good at a contest, I, you know, I'd bring the trophy in to them. And you know they would give me like 50 bucks for first place, and I could use it for in the store to go get stuff. So it was cool. I never tried to get sponsored; it just happened. You haven't seen the video yet. Gotta wait for the video. I like Colin Provost a lot and Westgate. I think Westgate actually, dude. Yeah, I'm gonna go with Westgate. That's who I want. I don't really know, man. We're uh, we're still filming. We go out every weekend with the team, and you know everyone's definitely still stacking clips. It's been a couple little weird things that have gone on with Plan B uh, recently, so we're working on it though. It's coming out. I don't know. It's kind of a shocking blow. You know, he's the team captain of Plan B, so yeah, I was a little bit, you know bummed out, still bummed out, but it's all good. P-Rod's the man, so whatever he's doing, I know it'll be, uh, it'll be awesome. P-Rod, you're the man. Come back to Plan B.